right, we are expecting some snow showers and rain showers to move back into the state, primarily from the system off the coast. It's going to move more into Southern California than, say, a direct hit for Northern California. Tonight in the Gilmore backyard, we have dry conditions, but the rain will pick up shortly after midnight with lows dropping into the 40s. Our sunrise at 722, and at that point, we'll still see some hit and miss showers. Had a great looking lunar halo sent into us by Terry from Groveland. You can see just the ice crystals highlighting the glow of the moon. Thanks so much for submitting that to our ABC 10 Weather Force through the app. You can upload the photos to our Weather Force and be a part of the team. Here's a look at what we're expecting for tomorrow. Areas of showers early in the morning for the Bay Area and Valley and then dry for the afternoon. Those showers linger for the foothills and the Sierra just a little bit longer in the day. As far as total accumulation, pretty weak system moving through. We'll see anywhere from about a tenth of an inch in the valley, closer to about two tenths to three tenths of an inch in the foothills. And as far as snow, about an inch or two of fresh powder up there for the high country. Moving on to that almanac, today's average high is 52 degrees. We hit 57, so we were a little bit warm for this time of year, and that low just a tad warm as well at 40. Normal low about 38, but it felt chilly out there this morning. We're still running quite a bit behind for that yearly uh, total for our season, which starts October 1st for the water year, not only for Sacramento executive, but also throughout the rest of the region, anywhere from about two and a quarters of an inch behind to over four inches behind in total rainfall. We've got several systems though lined up in the Pacific. Like I said, the first one hitting us tonight through early tomorrow is primarily going to hit Southern California. Lots of snow along 395 there, and then it clears out during the afternoon, dry on Tuesday and most of Wednesday. Then we start tracking this next weather system due in Wednesday night through Thursday stay with yet more rain off the coast. Highs will be in the 30s tomorrow for this year, right about the mid 40s to near 50 for the foothills. A couple of days of chances for snow Wednesday, Thursday and Friday for the high country with highs warming into the upper 30s to right around the low 40s. Highs in the 50s along the coast as we head inland. We're back into the 50s and again we'll see the mainly morning showers then dry for the afternoon and those highs will warm with mostly cloudy skies. Our 10 day forecast right now it looks like a dry New Year's Day because see a few showers New Year's Eve early in the day and then dry for the afternoon. And then our next opportunity for showers comes this weekend as well as on and off next week as well.